Hey guys, Adriano Pescetti from Wiser Real Estate. Welcome to my latest listing today. I'm in this beautiful town of Mernda, this amazing refreshed home here at 8 Arbor Street. Don't forget, like, share, tag someone in this post that may be interested. As always, I promise that we'll get to see this property before it hits the market. I know you're excited. Let's go through and check it out. But first, I want to whip around and just show you where we actually are. So you're actually in a very, now it is called, uh, street, Arbor Street, but it's actually not a street. Uh, it actually stops. So it is really, really quiet. And this is the view that you get from your front door. It's like a little reserve. It's like got a little walkway that takes you through, up and around, up to the main strip, where you've got Myrna shops. You've also got primary schools up there as well. And you're actually not too far from Myrna Villages, the iconic Bridge Inn Hotel, and of course, Myrna Station. So that's all within this beautiful community. We'll start at the start as we always do. So the owners have entrusted me with my extended team to get this place looking amazing. So as I go through, I'm gonna explain what we've done as well, okay? So at the start, as you can see with most of my homes, if you watched it, really low maintenance. Low maintenance bark, pebbles here. We've cut everything right back, trimmed back the trees. Um, you've, obviously this is part of the property, okay? And the other thing that you'll actually notice at the front, and I don't like to spend too much time um, at the front of homes, but you get these beautiful, beautiful gum trees. Look at this. Like this obviously has been here for many, many years. So the backdrop that you get, it actually feels like you're almost in a little bit of a country, country vibe and country view with, of course, that uh, park across the road. Double car garage, okay. Driveway to fit an extra two cars off street as well. The other thing we've gone and done is painted the driveway. We've got to install these LED lights throughout the front of the property as well as throughout the rest of the property just to make it pop from the front. So once we start doing more duskier opens, you'll actually see what I mean. Come, oh, hello. I knew I should have, I, there was a bigger step. Ah, oh, welcome home. Mind the step, you'll, you'll get to do that when you come through. And these videos are uncut, so you're gonna see all the bloopers. So the first thing that you notice is a nice long hallway. Now that little hallway draws you all the way to the back of the property where the living and the kitchen is, but we're gonna start at the front, come through. So, first room, as always, as general, you've got the nice, big, oversized master. So the one thing that you'll notice in these rooms, all the rooms are very, very large and very spacious, and they also really well lit because you've got nice, big windows, as you can see there, nice, big windows. We've got new block out blinds that we've installed as well. Okay, so nice big windows. The cool thing is you get to actually look at that view every day, which is pretty cool. So nice big, so this is a king size bed. And as you can see, still plenty of room either side. You've got plenty of room along the wall. Um, we've also laid fresh new, my favorite color, if you've watched my videos, nice plus charcoal carpets right through the home. And through, of course, being into the master, you get your own private ensuite. So this is the ensuite. It's actually a really good size ensuite, to be honest. Shower tucked around the corner, toilet. Uh, this is a laminate bench top, so not high end um, in relation to the fixtures of the bench tops, but very serviceable and you can easily update if you're wanting stone, very easy to do. Uh, there is one, you can do dual vanities if you want. You can add uh, shelving, you can add cupboards. This one's got a nice big mirror. So again, really practical um, and we've given it a really good clean and a paint throughout as well. And the other cool thing about this home, and you'll notice uh, when you actually come through, um, the, I'll actually show you the built-in robe first, so you can have a look at that. Really good space, so it's nice and high shelves. The one thing that you'll notice, and you know when the ceilings are generally higher, is you'll actually see the door arches are bigger than your standard 2.4. So this is about uh, 2.7, okay? So the ceilings are higher and all the doors and arches are taller, so you'll get that feel as you come through. Keeping coming through this way, guys. So you've got remote control garage through there. It is a double car garage, as I said. Okay, nothing really major. Garage, you've got side access to the side of the property through there. And you've got access into the house, as you can see there. The house is fitted with uh, central cool, uh, heating, sorry, I should say. So there's the ducted heating system there. We're gonna keep coming through. Now this uh, four bedroom house actually has two bedrooms at the front of the property and two bedrooms off the side. So this is the second. We've set this up as a single kitty room with a nice big desk, but 
The size of the room, you could easily fit a double or a queen size bed in here, and you'll be able to see that from the floor plan. But again, really spaced out. We've given it a nice, as I said, kitty feel. Um, this is fitted with built-in robes. Nice, big built-in. So you can see there, nice, big built-in robes. We've done the new carpet through the robes as well to give it uh, the new look and feel. So this home um, is ready to be moved into, okay? We're gonna keep coming through this way as we walk through. Uh, and this is your big kitchen, meals and lounge zone. But as always, we're gonna start in the kitchen. The one thing I love about this kitchen is its actual size. So you actually got loads of space from bench to bench, okay? So it's not a narrow kitchen. It's quite a good size kitchen, as you can see. Through here, big double refrigeration uh, spot that you can fit your fridge in. Water there, ready for plumbed water. So if you want those fancy fridges, which most people have these days, you can easily install that. We've gone and got nice uh, pantry space there. So again, this is a laminate kitchen. Um, you could easily update the kitchen if you want to and upgrade the laminate bench tops to stone. Um, but a it's an, and the one cool thing is it lies the bench space. So nice big bench space. We've gone and installed. Uh, so this is about just over 12 months old. Um, the gas cooktop. Now, I like to do this, but let's see. Yes, it's connected. It's over here, George. Look, there it is. Hello. So gas cooktop. This is brand new. Westinghouse, brand new uh, oven, as you can see there. So that is brand new. Dishwasher over here. As you can see, also brand new. So the only thing that's not brand new is the cooktop, but that's only about 12 to 18 months old. Uh, you've got dual tap uh, through there. The other cool thing is, because you've obviously got the sink on this, so you get the nice greenery as well. So you get something nice to look at. And as I said, like loads of cupboard space. You've got cupboards, you've got plenty of shelf space, either side, plenty of room. And the fact that you've got a nice elongated long bench that acts as a breakfast bar is actually really cool. So nice prep station, talk to the family, watch the kids as you're cooking and prepping. We've gone and added new pennant lights as well, just to make it some nice, break up the space. Um, I love to accentuate every zone. And we've also added nice LED lights throughout the property, as I mentioned initially. So this flows through into your dining zone, okay? Really good size central dining zone that breaks up the kitchen to the lounge area. As you can see, it's a six slash eight seater table. I think this size is perfect for this space, okay? Um, again, you could change it up, round table, longer table, bit more of a square table if you want, but I think this table fits perfectly. So as you see the video and you come through, you'll actually get a good sense, because uh, most buyers like to see what type of furniture fits. So I think this is perfect. And then that flows through into your beautiful, big, spacious, loads of natural light lounge area, okay? So it's been beautifully presented again from Lil and the team at Style Point, just to show you what you can actually do with this space, okay? Little sitting stool, sitting section, nice big couch. Again, really spacious. It, it gives nice um, contrast to the outside area. So and we'll show you that in a little bit. Um, we're gonna finish off outside actually. We'll show you that in last. But again, just to show you how much space there actually is. So these have got all new blinds throughout. So the home has been fully refreshed, so it's ready for you to move in. There is a split system around the corner there. As you can see, as George will show you that. So that does the main area of the house. And then we're gonna come through and I'm gonna show you the other two bedrooms. So they are through here. So this is all brand new carpet. So we've gone and laid all brand new carpet. We're gonna start up the top for bedroom number three. Again, as I said initially, all the bedrooms are really good size. Set up the bed this way, you can even spread it up the other way, but again, nice big queen bed. Just to show you how much space there actually is. Really good size. Built-in robes again. Nice, big built-in robes. Look at the size of those. You've got shelf space, and you've got hanging space on that side, and hanging space on this side. So again, really good size rooms. And I guess the other feature being that they've got the high ceilings, it just makes it nice, feel nice and bigger. You've got separate toilet away from the separate bathroom. So multiple people can use the wet areas. And again, very simple uh, bathroom, but cool thing does have a separate nice deep bathtub for those families with kids, separate shower and vanity. Again, la laminate bathroom. You could easily add value to that bathroom 
just by a few upgrades. Into the laundry, I might get George to swing in there. So again, no real frills to the laundry. Another area that you could easily add value to, just the trough, but obviously you've got room in the corner there for services like washing machine and whatnot. You've got a linen cupboard through here. As you can see, double doors. You're not gonna be able to see that on, obviously on the camera. Through into the fourth bedroom, again, double bedroom. As you can see there, just to show you space, both bedrooms are very, very similar. This one's got a slightly smaller wardrobe uh, than the other bedrooms, and generally one bedroom has a slightly smaller wardrobe. Um, but as you can see there, you've got shelf space and hanging space, a really nice backdrop to nice new artificial grass, but come through this way, and I actually wanna take you through and show you outside, okay? So this home, being that it's a family home, is extremely low maintenance. There is not one ounce of grass to cut, not one, okay? So when you come outside, you'll actually see this beautiful grass. We've just gone uh, laid some nice artificial grass. It's nice, it's new, it looks green, and it's green all year round. All you gotta do is just pluck out the weeds when they come in. Uh, all we've done is obviously laid some low maintenance mulch in the garden beds. That is your access through to your garage. We've also done new LED lights outside, so nice big flood lights here, so they're nice and bright of an evening, especially if you're gonna entertain your guests. This is the covered zone, okay? So it's quite a long entertaining zone. This actual area is perfect for entertaining. Um, we've painted the concrete, we've uh, updated the LED lights up here. The one thing that I would do, just to make the indoor outdoor feel, I would just cafe blind all this area down and maybe leave one area open, but at least you close yourself off from the elements and you can entertain all year round. That's what I'll do, add a nice little heater, a couple of ceiling fans, what more could you ask? Well, that's all, what it's all about in Australia. Coming up to the warm months, I guarantee you that if you're gonna be in before Christmas, you'll utilize this zone. And just to show you, like, look at this space. So you've got extra garden space. So again, for those families with kids, having an extra area out here, which obviously I've got to myself, this is perfect that it's, it's so low maintenance. They'll fall over, they won't hurt themselves. You can still set up gyms, you can still set up jumping castles, uh, trampolines, whatever you want in this area here, which is really, really cool. And then I'll show you up the side of the house as well. So up the side of the house, that's obviously where your services are, okay? New lights there, so they'll flick on because they are actually um, censored lights. We've gone and painted the concrete here. You've got the pull-up clothesline as well, tucked around the side. And that's it. That is the home, guys. So I think we might go around, we'll go back under here. We'll go back under? Yeah, we'll go back under. So, um, due to hit the market very, very shortly, uh, this one here is going to be going to auction uh, at some stage toward the end of November, so look out for that one. Again, as I said, it's a perfect home for you to move straight in and enjoy. Everything has been meticulously done, so the owners obviously have entrusted myself and my extended team to come in here and give this place a full makeover, ready for the next purchaser to move in and enjoy. And again, whether you're wanting it as a home to move into, whether you're wanting it uh, as an investment, Everything is ready to go, so you don't have to spend a cent. It is moving ready, and you're so close to everything else. So you've got shops up the road, you've got schools up the road, plenty of parks. I um, mean, you're not too far from Mena Station here as well. So everything is within close proximity of where your future home sits. So hopefully, guys, you enjoyed the tour. I know it was a little bit long. I just wanted to make sure I went through everything possible that I could think of. Um, I'm sure there'll be other stuff that you pick through as you come through the property. But again, hopefully you enjoyed the tour. As I said initially, guys, don't forget, like, share, or tag someone in this post that may be interested. They will get to see the property before it hits the market. Alternatively, if you've got any other questions about this home or any of our other homes, you can always like and follow us on all our socials, our Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, or subscribe to our YouTube channel at My Agent Real Estate, where you'll get to see not only this property, but all our properties that are up for sale, but anything real estate as well, rental properties, uh, market updates, the works. It's all on our YouTube channel for you guys to watch. Um, if you've got any other questions about this home, or any questions about your home and you're thinking of selling your home, whether it's just before Christmas and you don't have a lot of time, if you wanted to get in, most people now are starting to plan for next year. Um, obviously, we've had a bit of an indifferent market this year with obviously interest rate rises and whatnot. So 
this is the perfect time if you're thinking of selling your home to start to get a, your head around what potentially you may need to do to maximize your price. Love to come out and give you uh, an appraisal and have a chat to you about why we are different right across Melbourne and surrounds. Feel free to give me a call 0402 055 437. Thanks guys for taking the time and having a tour. I can't wait to meet you one of the opens. Thanks.